Hi, this is Ryan from Foxtech, and today I'm going to show you how to annotate on a PDF using your iPad. There are a few different ways to do this, and I'll walk you through the best options to make it as easy as possible. First off, there are several apps you can use to open and annotate PDFs, such as Adobe Acrobat, GoodNotes, or even Apple Books. But personally, I prefer to use the Files app because that's where most of my PDFs are stored. It's simple, straightforward, and built into the iPad, so you don't need to download anything extra. Once you've opened your PDF in the Files app, tap on the Annotation or Markup tool, which usually looks like a pencil or highlighter icon. From there, you'll see a variety of tools to choose from, like a pen, highlighter, or eraser. If you have an Apple Pencil, this is where it really shines. You can make precise notes and highlights with ease, though using your finger works too. If you don't have the Apple Pencil, it just won't be as precise. If you need to add text, you can tap on the text tool to type comments or notes directly onto the PDF. You can also adjust the color and thickness of your pen or highlighter to suit your needs. This gives you a lot of flexibility, whether you're making simple notes or detailed annotations. Once you've finished marking up the PDF, don't forget to save or export it so that your changes are kept. The Files app makes this easy, and you can even share the annotated PDF via email or cloud storage. If you need more advanced features, third-party apps like Notability or GoodNotes offer additional tools for annotating, organizing, and managing your PDFs. These apps are especially useful if you're handling a lot of documents and want some extra functionality. Thanks for watching. If this video helped you, be sure to like and subscribe for more useful tips. See you later.